Hey guys, this is Kirob speaking and today we're back in Pro Cycling Manager 2019 with Herbert Huff and Puff. And he is huffing and puffing through the Tour de South or Circuit Cycliste South uh, or some, some, something of that kind. Pronunciation, yo. Uh, and we are, I think, in the last two stages. Yes, that looks about right. And those, I think, were a little bit more um, interesting. Uh, interesting profiles for Herbert Huff and Puff, who unfortunately is very allergic to energy gels. Uh, yeah, that that looks like a pretty tough one. We're currently in 48th. Hopefully that changes. Ah, such a beautiful day. How is Herbert doing today? Oh, beautiful. Beautiful. Uh, 30 kilometers of work. And, okay, that isn't all that steep. Hmm, a puncher finish, not a mountain finish. We have plus two in the main stats, so decent. We should be able to follow along. All right, the breakaway is gone away. And 60 still gets us pretty far from the looks of it. So let's go 55 and do some lead work. Infinite relay. And see if we can't... Um, get their lead extended to two minutes and get our work done for today of course that's not optimal for finishing highly but then again yeah i i don't have high hopes anyway the question is if we can squeeze this down to 52 or something yeah oh oh no you you guys stay that's more than two what separating them. why are they fuck that no stop stop don't don't, don't. Why are you guys still attacking? What is this about? Uh, what? What? Are they going for the sprint or something? Let's see. How many points? There are no points left. <laughs> Why are you attacking? Are you seriously going for the two minute thirty gap? That doesn't happen that often. Well, they actually did make it across. So, oh, and more attacks are going. What the hell? The AI is a little weird today. All right, we are pulling again. This time, hopefully, uh, we can finish our job in a little bit more of a calm climate without the tax going, despite them being away for two minutes 30. All right, there we have the 100%. Let's overdo our job a little bit. Yeah, 36. 37. All right, let's call that a day then. Lost a significant amount of stamina as per usual. Well, don't ride backwards. Oof, okay. People are already falling off the rear here. Uh, so I do have to up it to 80. They have been riding a little harder. Uh, certainly up the pace. Let's move forward. Uh, position ourselves somewhere up front. And we are doing a little better than our, all our teammates, it looks like. Well, that's good news. Uh, yeah, this group is falling apart. And we're still doing well. Yeah, despite uh, having lost so much stamina there. Um, yeah, that's pretty good. Now let's up it to 85 for the next climbs. Yeah, yeah, okay. We're moving along, moving along. Uh, they have not upped the, the pace all that much. And some other guys are... Mm, damn, this peloton is a lot larger now again. And it's two more of these climbs. So maybe we get rid of them again. No, yeah, and we're back to 21 riders. Moving hard. Come on, guys, move already. That is not very fast. I don't want the yellow jersey to catch up. That will be a bad, bad, bad move. Well, I, I don't really care about the yellow jersey. <laughs> I pretend to care. Uh, no, we are so far back in the uh, in the standings that that of course doesn't matter. But there's a single rider up front who's just getting loads and loads of time. Maybe I can just move. No, they are moving pretty hard now. They are moving pretty hard. Uh, Two point five kilometers. So let's go ninety five. Be efficient about it. Yes, that's good. Ah, oh, that rider is being caught. Two kilometers left. Still going hard. They're going harder. 
They are going harder. 1.5. I'm moving as efficiently as I can, but they are crushing it, of course. And yeah, 95. That was all good. We are in the first group, I believe. Yeah, we should be in the first group. So that's basically the best result we could have gotten here. Yeah, that's in the top 15. 12th. Nice. Not too bad for Mr. Huffenpuff. And we can continue on and we do get 10 points for our exceptional lead work. <sighs> okay. Oh no, Habit. Did you did someone squeeze some energy gel into you? Oh no. Ah, you're sick. You have the sniffles or something. Doesn't feel well, I guess. Diarrhea. No, does not feel well. Um, that's a shame. That doesn't help. Because we are second in the under 25s. And... Uh, it's our guy who is in first. <laughs> Alright. We need to beat him somehow. Um, well, uh, these climbs look a little tedious. I think I'm going to... Uh, depending on our race day condition, of course. I'm going to skip today's uh, work for the team and see if we have a chance to uh, get a good finish. Whew, that's some weather. That's some weather right there. And we do have a... Um, uh, a plus one. Holy shit. We rolled a plus one. Now, what are we supposed to do today? Work for them. Nah, nah. Look at these climbs. This is... Very, very good terrain for us to save some energy over the others. So, no, I'm not going to do any work today. Instead, we try to uh, get the maximum out of this. And, whoa, they are chasing hard. They are chasing those poor bastards. Four of them. Oh, whoa, what happened there? Almost fell off the back, it seemed. Whoa, 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 you guys are moving way too hard. Are these some... Minor climbs, yeah, okay. At least 70 to hang in there. Yeah, okay, that's just about right. Oh, those roads are tiny. Okay, that will be a little rough. Uh, makes it makes it very dangerous to do the yo-yoing because you can get be, uh, stuck behind fat asses. Yeah, okay. It's a tough one. All right, we are yo-yoing a little bit. Uh, the peloton is starting to wear down. And these guys don't slow down at all. Uh, 35 kilometers left to go. The SKP still have two minutes. Yeah, they're really starting to grind down the peloton. 49 riders remain. And a few more sharp climbs. Uh, let's be a little bit careful here now. This is one of the last ones. Let's go 85 dot. Because we don't want to get stuck behind someone. And maybe they're breaking off at the front. They look like they're trying. Yeah, they are. Okay. Okay. Well, everyone is moving. So we just keep our pace. Uh, it's looking good. So we made it across this one. And now we need to get into a very good position, if possible. Let's move 90. Yes, yes, yes. Moving through, coming through. And now into the downhill. It's fine. We are in a very good position. It's a little tricky. Um, all right, let's uh, let's try to manually do this. All right, we're keeping a good position here. You are probably. Oh, okay. Very good. Um, we can follow you. Or you. Let's see. Yes, we're following. No. Oh, oh, we are boxed in. We're boxed in. Go 90 instead. We're now in the climb. Go out to the side. Go 95 maybe. Go 95. Okay, go hard. Go hard. Go hard. Go hard. We need to follow you. Come on. You're the sprinter guy. It's the final kilometer though. I mean, if we sprint, nothing happens. Because of our shitty sprint, so that's not helpful. Um, if he sprints, we are just left behind anyway. But this is the downhill, so 
I think he might be he might be good. So let's let's just start the sprint. Start the sprint. Come on. Half and puff. Go go Mr. Half and puff. Oh! Oh, we are stealing third. <laughs> we just stole third place. Yes. Our powerful sprint brought us a podium finish. Well, that downhill in the end that really helped because the sprinters couldn't go any faster. Too much air resistance, too many corners. Oh, that was spot on. Oh, look at that! We're top 15! Ah, damn it, he's still in front of us, though. Not enough bonus seconds. Yeah, second place there. Not too bad, not too bad. Uh, 34 points overall. Still 45 left to go for the level up. Oh, okay. Well, this doesn't look like we have too much of competition. Some uh, good sprinters in here, of course. But then if you look at this, and this is the number five in the favorites, then you know, okay, the overall quality of the race is not as high. I mean, he's a, he's a good rider, but good only, not exceptional or anything. So we might have a chance to do some good results in this tour overall. Let's check it out. Uh, we do have... If we go profile one, this super long stage, fuck that. Um, this one, very interesting finish, also super long. That one is just cruel. Uh, that is a mountain, a big one. Uh, we are going to grind it out there with our l complete lack of resistance. Would be so nice if we until then would have a level up, but that's probably not going to happen. Then another flat one, a puncher stage, and another flat one, and that's it. Okay. Yeah, cool tour. Whoa, that's a wide road. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> All right. Uh, race day condition, please. Race day condition, minus one. All right. Um, well, that is not good for our stamina. But the stage of all is pretty flat, so... But very long. Ouch. Well, we stay well protected and see how it goes. And there are no XP points to grab today anyway. Uh, just do your best, Herbert. Haufen poof. They have been chasing for quite a while. That was a rough first of 40 ish kilometers. Um, and now, settled down, four SKPs up front, just three minutes on the clock, and we are riding along. 160 kilometers left to go. For stages like these, you really need the 16 times time acceleration. <laughs> oh man, I've been chatting to the unicorn all day long, and still, the day isn't gone yet. Alright, um, our team is trying to catch these SKPs, uh, or taking part in it at least, and there they are gone. Um, 10 kilometers remaining, and we are heading into a fierce sprint by Herbert. Let's have a look. Five more kilometers. So time to slow down a bit. And position-wise, hmm, there's not much we can do. Uh, let's get out to the side. And can we move? Come on, Herbert. Oh, they're going already. They are going already. That's way too early. Um, let's go 99. Come on, accelerate. There. Follow someone. Uh, Follow someone. Uh, 1.9 kilometers. No, no, no. Just go 99 or 95 right now because everyone has slowed down. Oh, there are more people going. Um, okay. Can we, can we follow him instead? Yeah. I, I mean, we we follow him, <laughs> follow his slipstream, and then he will overtake us, and then we follow his slipstream, and then he will overtake us, and then we follow his slipstream. Let's see how it plays out. Uh, there we go, and there we go. Come on, Herbert, come on, and sprint so that you don't fall off. Um, yeah, okay. <coughs> Very successful. Oh, our guys! Ho holy shit. Our guy actually came second. Well, that wasn't a bad effort at all. Uh, we're not getting any points for that, of course. Uh, yeah, not, not too successful uh, start of the tour. Uh, tomorrow's stage will probably be the same way. It's also a flat one. Yeah, not quite. Not quite. We do have an interesting fourth category climb there. Eight kilometers out from the finish. 
Mm, but the actual slope is more like 10 kilometers away. Or 12 kilometers away. Uh, yeah, not, not something that Habit can really deal with. Um, not in a way that would give us a time advantage over the Peladon. But, yep, yeah, let's race it. And here we go. We are, oh, oh, are you fucking kidding me? Minus three, Habit. Holy shit, this will be a rough day. We have stamina rating of 53 on a 212 kilometer stage. Ouch. All right. Stay in the middle of the pack and don't move. And unfortunately, they're chasing like crazies. Uh, still chasing, yes. Uh, please slow down. Please slow down. It's still less than two minutes gap. Okay, now they've settled. 3.30 on the clock. 150 kilometers left to go. And now just imagine this day at a minus three with a stage racer uh, on this level that um, has a specialization that doesn't give any flat. We would have a flat rating of around 60 and stamina still around the same. So <laughs> how would that go? <laughs> Probably not too well. All right, we kept kept in there for a long, long time. And I think now is the time to set it to 85 and roll with them. Because now they have accelerated. And yeah, just hang in there. It's just a little hill. And then downhill towards the next one, we should be able to um, to get back to the front there. Ooh, we almost ripped. <laughs> At 85, we almost ripped. Holy shit. All right, now we're getting back to the front. Um, Hebert, why, why the fuck do you not move? Come on. Don't get stuck behind fat asses again. We're on a racetrack, by the way. Uh, the question is, which one? Uh, yeah, okay. Okay, that's that's a hill. That's a pretty steep one at that. Oh, yes. That is a nasty hill. Let's go 95, because that is the last obstacle, really. After that, we can easily recuperate. Yeah, we're getting through here quite nicely, quite nicely. Some attacks going and stuff, but um, we're riding efficiently. We, we're staying with them. Uh, are we? Are we? Go, ni go 99. <laughs> go 99, Abbott. I'm not so sure about that. that oh, 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 22 riders. So let's hang in here. Um, follow, follow him. D don't sit back, you idiot. Oh, man. His st stupid fucking AI. Um, or rather the systems that make you decide where the hold position actually is. So, here we have maybe a bit of a chance. Let's go. No, no, they're moving super hard. They are moving so hard. Holy shit. Okay, 99 is just about right <laughs> to follow along. No, no chance to uh, do anything here. Um, unless, of course... We attack! That was a surprise attack! We got seven seconds. No. No. Um, no, we just go 99. And... What are you doing, mate? Are you are you pulling the pack towards me? Or are you trying to escape? Um, yeah, I don't know. Right, this is not looking all that great. What, could you stop sprinting, please? There we go. There we go, Herbert. There you go, nine seconds, five seconds. It's not great. Could you please? Fucking hell, the whole team is, is trying to catch me. And there they do. And I'm almost empty. So now let's go 99 from here then instead. Uh, we're back on the racetrack. Uh, I'm almost out of... Uh, fucking idiot. There. Yes, okay. And now... One kilometer left. We it's 50, 52 riders. Oh shit! We are almost empty. Um, Seven hundred meters. I think we will have thick legs here. Yeah, we will have thick legs. <laughs> that didn't last, but it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter because we were way too slow anyway. So no bigger changes in. Oh no! Overall, we now have the leader, and that will change on tomorrow's stage. 
Uh, also, I want to point out that having a decent downhill rating from the start is actually quite good. Uh, 67, not too sucky in comparison to my other stats. And that is the stage. Let's get into it, because we still have some time today. Uh, what a climb. Holy fuck, that is going to be massive. And uh, yeah, there are some, some at least decent uh, riders in here. <coughs> A little bit better than uh, than what I'm. Oh no, not this guy. Uh, okay, uh, yes, race it. Save some energy if possible, and then just hammer it home. Uh, we still have excellent freshness that helps, but um, race day condition bias of zero. We need a better roll than a minus three. Well, holy shit, I'm stupid. Stage, stage four. Not stage three. All right. I didn't press the record button. It crashed. I stopped the recording, did something else, came back, raced stage number three, which was a beautiful mountain stage. <laughs> it was a beautiful mountain stage. Okay, let me let me tell you how it went. <laughs> let me tell you how it went. So, um, escape group going. Escape group growing, they, they weren't chased that much, so very fortunate. Habit was happy. Happy habit. Happy habit in the, this sector. Then, coming into here, the uh, the peloton started going like madmen up up the the hill, but Herbert, with his zero race day condition, um, managed to hang in there with uh, energy saving 60 activated, and the same thing happened here, and he was able to hang in there at uh, just barely 65, still good, and he was he was he was feeling well, he was feeling well, doing well too, and uh, just hanging in there, and uh, minding his own business. And then we moved down here. All was good. All was good. And then came the hills. The hills were terrifying to have it. Because the hills were what, um, were, uh, pro uh, what supposedly was uh, killing him. But no, no. He managed to survive just fine on 75 dots. But yes, the Peloton accelerated and went up there like crazies, probably 85 or 90. And we yo-yoed our way back and forth and barely managed to stay connected over this this one. Not that we um, couldn't stay connected, but we were trying to do our darnest to save energy. And just able to stay connected here, no energy wasted. We're moving down into the valley, always good. A little bit of a breather, regained all our resistance again. Still in a full peloton, the escapees were caught around here. And then this little hill, uneventful. We just stayed in front, yo yo back a bit, and it was fine. The peloton was moving hard up these slopes, no escapees up in front. And then this climb was absolutely terrifying. That is an average gradient of, what was it? Uh, what was the average gradient? Something like nine-ish percent, ten, nine and a half? Like completely crazy steep. Um, 10 kilometers, very much exactly 10.4. And I decided, as per usual, to um, do a dot rating. Dot 75 was the average I decided on. And that worked really well. The Peloton disconnected uh, us there approximately, so right at the start. <laughs> Like <laughs> 80 riders just moving past me like okay you guys go I can't I can't do that speed I know habit he <laughs> can't do that speed and what happened then well uh, one after the other 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 what happened well we rained them all basically all back in again apart from uh, the winner and six others no five others we came seventh Holy shit, we came seventh. Um, let's uh, let's take a look at, at this. Uh, where do we have it? So, uh, where are we now? Uh, there, there, seventh overall. So, one minute and 53 seconds back on the previous stage. Um, and, yeah. Didn't get any XP for that. And that was, that was sucky. We were supposed to do lead work after all. But now we're in seventh, so I hope that summarizes the stage nicely. And unfortunately, I couldn't show you because that <laughs> fucking record button. Um, yeah, yeah, that was fun. Um, anyway, I think then we have to race this stage too, man. 
because I fucked that up. Um, all right, let's get going. And race day condition time. What do we get? Uh, it is a negative one, but a reasonably easy stage today. Oh, we we have a helper. Is this the first time we have a helper? I believe it is. Let's lock him in <laughs> instantly. Let's lock him in. Uh, yeah, because we are now in seventh overall, we get a helper. And, but, yeah, unfortunately, that means that we don't have the option of doing teamwork uh, to get some XP. Nah, uh, but fortunately, we will get some XP at the end of the race if... Mm, if 7th can be held, but I think it can. Oh, look at the Israelis, Goldstein and Einhorn. Yes. Um, l let me guess what country they fled when <laughs> before they came there. Um, yeah, uh, Goldstein just means Goldstone and Einhorn means Unicorn. So, yes, very German. And now they have to protect the Austrian rider, uh, Herbert Adolf Hufenpuff. <laughs> Well, there's absolutely nothing happening this stage, which is great news. It's absolutely great news. But now we are getting closer to those slopes, and let's take position right up front and see if we. Yeah, we need just need to stay there. Um, I don't think there will be any attacks going. Let's amp it up to 90. If we pass this hill, then we're fine. We have plenty of resistance, so it should be good. Let's see how it goes. Yeah, they're moving really hard, but. We are, of course, hanging in there, using some red. Oh, why do you fall back so much? All right, we are across. This looks like a manual job is required, uh, because they are really doing some maneuvering here. I don't want to be left behind. There we go. Okay, hold position. Um, the peloton broke up. 30 riders only remaining. And now we're getting boxed in. I do want to be able to sprint, of course. Uh, let's um, go ahead and position ourselves a little better. On the outside of the corner. Yep, yeah, okay. Outside of the corner, three kilometers left to go. Can we follow anyone? Are, are you decent in sprints? I have no clue. But you are very decent in sprints, so... Oh, no. Oh. Is... Are we following him? Come on. You are a great sprinter. You are le currently leading the jersey, so... Pull me to, to safety, Mikkel. Are you Mikkel? I think so. Um, yeah, let's go. Let's go. Let's go, mate. Let's go, mate. Uh, pull the sprint. Oh. Sprint. Sprint, sprint. How about sprint? <laughs> How about go. You can do it. Well, we are in the first group. That's, that's good news. And he actually won. So we, we supported him with um, giving him some, some draft, uh, like better aerodynamics behind him, less turbulators. Uh, so yeah, yeah, that was essential. Uh, our lead out was powerful. So oh, that's good news. He's crushing it. That's awesome. And we are still in seventh. So do we get anything for that? I highly doubt it. Nope, no, nothing. Uh, let's take a look at what the uh, remaining stages are in this tour and then uh, sign us off. Oh yes, the puncher stage. That will be a tricky one, but I think we can hang in there. So, and it's not too long. Should be in our favor in that regard. Um, hmm, uh, Habit isn't doing too well. But anyway, that should be it for today. I hope you enjoyed and see you guys next time.